I'm sorry. The fuck. They're like, what, 50 meters away from you? Why the fuck do I have to walk all the way over here just for that? I'm sorry, couldn't you have just walked in here and asked yourself? Wow, we've been doing this. Back in the day, I had a huge, a massive, and well, and a workshop, Dad. Yes, a workshop. So where is it? You're not in one now, Alberto. <laughs> Sophie sent me. She says you know where they can find some crystals. Oh, for fucks! They've already sent one of their f f f f f f f fuckwits. Who? That fellow, <laughs> Sophie's brother, huh? What was the asshole's name? Barney. The asshole's name is Barney. And he asked the same question about a dark zone with crystals. Yeah, that's news to me. So where is that dark zone? It's a hundred... Uh, 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 a hundred and twenty... Uh, uh, a hundred and... <laughs> Dad, can I tell him? Oh, please. A hundred meters from the metro. There's a big sign. Fashion store. And a windmill on the other side of the street. Uh, thanks. I invite you to browse. My sister found some weird tapes inside an abandoned. Seriously, there's no time. Oh, I actually realized something. We have that. Captain Posner to Colonel Williams. Status report for Monday, December 16th, 2024. One of my men needed a doctor immediately, so I hurried to the nearest garrison led by Major Matt. It seemed the wisest course of action, all things considered. The squad doesn't know I'm working on a morale assessment. The news of General Pratt's death had little emotional impact on the men. They did not respect him, believing that he had lost control of the situation a long time ago and was unable to make difficult decisions. They have a lot of respect for you, sir. I've also spoken to Major Matt, but he's hard to read. He avoided mention of you, and that's significant. He has a group of loyal soldiers who are at his beck and call. He clearly revels in his power, and exhibits the behavior of a man who will always seek more power. Can you count on him? I will find out in the coming days. Hey. And, well, what did you find? I know the location, but I always told your brother asked about it already. Herman, see if Barney turned on his radio. Barney, answer me. Barney. So that's why he's gone offline. He's looking for the crystals on his own. And throwing a wrench in the works yet again. This isn't the first time, I gather. No. He's always trying to prove himself. Last time, he got wounded. Wasn't that long ago, either. The fucking kid. I'll kill him. I'll just kill him. Why blame yourself? We all make our own beds. Listen. You said it yourself. You're new here, so you don't know much. I'm responsible for security here, and he's my brother. I promised I'd look after him. You promised? Promised who? Never mind. I'll kick Barney's ass when he gets back. How'd Barney get wounded? He didn't want to tell me. My guess is that the PK's got a hold of him. Your brother keeps secrets from you? That's none of your business. Barney, answer me. Damn it all to hell. If he went to a dark zone in his condition, he's a goner. I can try to track him down. <laughs> you? I've been in a dark zone before. In the GRE hospital. St. Joseph Hospital? Really? If you save him, you won't regret it. We still have some time. 
Barney will likely wait till dusk. Going into a dark zone during the day is suicide. Just bring him back home safe. I'll do my best. Good luck. Hey, we can craft the immunity boosters ourselves now. Ah, oh, but he's just chamomile as well. We're gonna end up burning through so much chamomile. I'll pick up the. Oh, there. Uh, what do we have? Oh, okay, so yeah, medicine is split between high tiers and lower tiers. I'll keep the low, just go for the low tier ones for now. Uh. This one. Why I keep getting random waypoint all the way up? Not sure that. So there, there. What's the other? Oh, there's also one up here. What is side quest first? Okay, so I have to go press shift again now to stop it. Aider. I'm listening. That's Aiden. I've just been offered an extremely shady deal. Maybe it'll turn up a lead on Lucas. I need more than just leads, Aiden. Whatever it is, check it out. Will do. Over and out. <laughs> I thought you made a UV immunity booster a lot more use later on. You have a lot more time to put to. Aha, uh -huh, let's um. We're just saying that. Ow. Damn it. Yeah, every time I try to switch weapons, I end up hitting two. Hey, hey, combat skills. Um, doesn't help because we don't have a range weapon.
Oh, we got a kick. Good one. Call. Oh. Not having range for possessing it kind of sucks. I keep setting the ground on fire. Constantly set the ground on fire, so it won't be so annoying. Come on. I backed up into something. Put those ones back. Uh, what's this one? Regeneration booster, rage booster. You know what, let's get this rage booster. I don't want to use it now, but this is gonna take forever, boys. Increased damage, but so that's the problem. Oh, okay. Hey, we got plus five bears there. There's more new threats. All the way over here, so um, I think we might at least. Uh, up here. So it's nice that it gives me five more bears. So. Wait a second, it's like no enemies around here. It's nice that there was a note that made that. We could just log pick and get some useful stuff out of it.
gap now. broke into the wrong place. How'd you find my secret entrance? You call that a secret? It was supposed to be. You're out of luck, though, buddy. I still don't know anything about anything. A Dodger sent me. Dodger? Uh, who is... Oh. He told me to say sayonara. That help? Okay. Shit. You should have started there. Dodger's looking for the order you owe him. <laughs> I bet. See that? Busted leg. That's why I don't have Dodger's order. You need help? Nah. Wait. Don't go back to him. He finds out I botched the job. I'm done around here. What should I tell him? Don't matter. He won't give a shit. He'll think I'm fucking him over. Hi. Can you go for me? Check out this storage area in an underground parking lot on St. Joseph Street. Cross the fence right in front of the massage parlor, enter the building, and head down the elevator shaft. Well, hey, slow down. First, what would I be looking for if I did this for you? GRE containers. According to the rumor that reached Dodger, there was a military installation here set up in the first days of the outbreak. And where there's military, there's usually a healthy stash of supplies. Uh, what kind of supplies? Don't know for sure, but usually good stuff from before the outbreak. It was only the finest for the military. Medicine, booze, whatever. <laughs> oh, no wonder Dodger wants this delivery so badly. Yep. Here, take these bangers and give it a try, will you? Oh, nice more decoys. It'd be a big score for all of us, but I'm out of the running now. Literally. What happened to your leg? Got jumped by bandits as I approached the site. Barely managed to get away. If you don't do this, Dodger will kill me. So this is a military base? Yeah. They sprang up all over the city at the start of the outbreak. The base has a military side and a civilian side. <laughs> the military side has the good stuff. The civilian side probably has more infected than loot. Look for the military entrance and you can't go wrong. Well, once you're inside, be careful. Getting to the storage area won't be easy. The setup usually includes generators. Find them to fire up their UV lights. <laughs> That'll help against the biters that'll be camping out there. Why do you work for Dodger? You need to ask. Same reason as you. We gotta do what we gotta do to survive. Dodger tips me off where I might find valuables and I go there. If I find some good stuff, I take a cut. Tiny one. A sliver. You know what vultures guys like Dodger are. Barely enough to live on, but it's better than nothing, I guess. The worst is when Dodger gives me a bum lead. Then I get fuck all. That's happened more than once. No skin off Dodger's nose, though. He's got plenty of guys like me working for him. Okay. I'll be back as soon as I can. Thanks. You're saving my ass by doing this, buddy. Uh, but, but I'd wait till night falls to go there. Both zones are probably filled to the brim with infected right now. Uh, thanks for the tip. Not that I'm in a hopeless situation, but I can you hurry. Stuff. What's the nearest? Um, I'm like 
my next hood. I did not expect to make that. Thought we were gonna fall. Waiting for night. Oh, we gotta be on the ground, so we gotta watch out for the howlers. Yeah, our weapon's almost broken. Okay, so don't just take a need help we'll be fine thanks what happened we heard a rumor about this garage we thought it'd be an easy score but we were wrong dumbasses hey hey at least we got far enough down to start up the old military generator and juice up some uv lights so what happened then further down the underground parking is fucking swarming with infected <sighs> barely made it out of there alive and then Part of a wall collapsed on Jonas on our way to the surface. Well, you won't mind if I give it a try, do you? Knock yourself out. But it's probably not worth it. Unless you want to end up <laughs> like me. Or worse. Yeah, I gotta make good on a promise. Here, if you manage not to die, maybe you'll find use for these. We sure ain't going back. <sighs> not that way, at least. Well, thanks. Can you hear those noises downstairs? That yeah, like well, I was sort of one that beat him up. Ah, uh, beat up. Yeah, Huey. Huey. Oh, there's a howler down here. Fuck. He's somewhere. Else.
Not that if we need to do that, how it looks. I'm just gonna. Oh, I might. I mean, high places, but definitely gonna end up uh, in at least some of them. to us. Oh wait, why has it forget? I just put the belt swing back on. Kinda ran the moment I came out on the on the table. I can't see a thing. I don't. You're stuck like that now. Around and able yet.
Looks like being stopped anyway for safety. Get close enough. Yeah, leave it. There's no hells on this floor. I don't think we walk in one up. Okay, so you can force a walk, but it requires two picks to have one. do that but I suppose if you're gonna go hurry it's useful. I think this is the military storage area Hubert told me about. Let's look around. That house good. <laughs> oh, I was gonna say if it can if it howls through that great I'm so annoyed. expecting to look up and have it just bolting at me. Well, we guess get, get <laughs> Look. Yeah, was well, I look away to have to do the one in front of us. And all of a sudden, the zombie... The Bible just oh he made it over to us. <laughs> that one saw me.
Ooh, gotta be a bit more careful though. Kolo and everything. Filters. Never gonna have enough of these. I'm sure Dodger can use them. Oh, a lot. Oh, Jerry, what? Uh, here we are. What a master pike. What a master pike. If with regret that I must deny your request for additional weapons and personnel. As one who allocates resources for your base, I'm sure you understand the strain our entire system is under during this... Sorry. During this accursed outbreak. You need to make do with what you have. As with all personnel... I'd say... As with all personnel, hopefully this will be over soon and we'll just go home. Best, Major Nagler. Nagler. Not that. That's one. Else to in a second. Looks like I struck gold. A bottle of risen glory cognac. And some cigars. Hmm, Cuban, Sabak says. Looks like I got everything of value. Time to head out of here. Okay. And then. Oh, so we got the whole set. It's with my sister. It's my sincere hope you receive this message. As you know, the situation has gone from bad to total ship show. We now cut off from several other installations, including yours. My sincere hope is that you and your men can hunker down and fight out the coming storm. God be with you. Major Nadler. A brief note of thanks to for the exquisite, exquisite cognac, cognac that you sent me. Dulls of all of these cursed creatures, I'll tell you. Your generosity is well noted. I might be able to allocate more munitions to your base after all. Rest assured, I will look into it. Cheers, General. After us? I can't. Okay. I'm confused how so I call him Master Pipes one. Who was right now? No. He wasn't. So why do we see on this side to move it? Oh, can we just kind of. 
much into it. find the stash sure did thanks for the lock picks but what are you still doing here is this him sure is it was kind enough to get the goods for us saved us a lot of trouble very good so where did you find out about this a little bird was it to you was it a little bird met a broken leg how would you know because i broke it why'd you attack him Huber was planning to take the goods for himself. Tell Dodger he didn't find anything. Needed our help to pull it off. But we didn't know why we needed half fast Hubi. And now we don't need you. So, give them to us. Three against one? I like those odds. Count again. I counted. Five corpses. Kill him and take the goods. We can. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on. Ready for this? <laughs> Don't let it I guess a power attack has to have the add effect of training there. A second ball. Something there. Oh, 
Wait, do we go have... We just have the entire night while we're here. <laughs> Sounds like it. Hey, decoy. He burned through. Burned through that hole. That's not that I gave you many and you can't make them yet. Metro station. Watching Johnson Mark and now dead. Oh, we'll see what consequences that makes us. Right, anyway, I need to quick have a look. I guess this is Bill Hawk at some point, but yeah. We now actually have a decent. Can I just drop some of these? Yeah, we can. I think I'm trying to actually like go through all the items. Just drop some of the low tier ones. Otherwise, we're gonna miss the number eight. Time we got in there a lot easier. How's the leg? Uh, no better. But it'll heal. Eventually. Oh, fantastic. Something wrong? I had a chance to meet the bandits you mentioned before. They said that you'd plan on cheating Dodger after all. Okay. The cat's out of the bag. But look, it was only gonna be just this once. Dodger would never find out. Why would you steal from a man who's giving you work? Look, I'm living by the skin of my teeth here. I thought just this once I'd pretend he gave me a bum lead and take the whole stash. Maybe get a little ahead for once. And the bandits? I figured an ambush would sell the story better. Didn't expect them to turn on me. But then, I'm an idiot, aren't I? Seems like it. Trusting a group of thugs like them. That's what you get for being greedy. I wasn't being greedy. Just, just desperate. Now I got a busted leg and don't know when I can work again. Uh, what happened to them anyway? Well, they tried to kill me, but didn't. Whew. Uh, and, and, and the goods? Did you reach them? I got everything. I'm begging you, don't tell Dodger. If you do, you'll ruin me. Please, d take what you have to him. Tell him I'll be back in business as soon as my leg heals. 
How'd you even get mixed up with low lives like that? Seemed reasonable enough at first. Uh, you're interested in helping for a small cut. Then they show up with this psycho Klaus. Damn it. I'm such an idiot. I, I, I brought this all on myself. Don't tell Dodger, please. I'll think it over. Come on, man. Without work, I'll starve. I, I won't even think about doing it again. I, I swear. Don't make me laugh. Think I'd take your word for anything after this? Uh, believe me, I, I learned my lesson. I'll never do anything like that again. We'll see. So we don't get much choice on this though. I got I got out choice for this quest. Hey, how you going? Sorry, I just looked at I just now looked at chat. Water for sale? I'll take half a crystal for sale. What you got for me? I found these filters for one. Mm, okay, I'm not setting my world on fire, but I can move those for a nice profit. How about these? A bottle of cognac and a box of cigars. Now that's what I'm talking about. You see? I knew there'd be something valuable at that military base. You see that, Urban? Can I sniff out the good shit or what? <laughs> Kick ass. Uh, speaking of asses, what was Hubie's deal? Is he trying to duck out on me? Uh, Hubert broke his leg, so I went and got the goods for him. He could use a doctor, or at least someone to look in on him while he's on the mend. Oh yes, he'll definitely need a doctor. What are you talking about? You know what they say, trust in God? But break your camel's legs, just in case. Couldn't hug. What? Hey, this psycho works for you? Well, two solutions are better than one. You wanted to kill me? No, who said anything about killing? I just told Klaus to get the loot. He can be a little overeager at times. You jackass! Oh, come on, don't pout. Look at Klaus. He's not mad about you killing his friends. It's natural selection. You proved yourself stronger than them. You came in handy after all. I didn't know how to get to Hubi, but then you showed up. I waited until you were gone and paid him a visit. What did you do to him? He was in terrible pain because of that broken leg. So I broke the other one. For balance. That's what happens when you try to screw Dodger. You fucking out of your mind? No need to get all broken up about it. Duralex said Lex. The times we live in are ruthless, and the law must be so too. He's already learned his lesson. He said he wouldn't do it again. Mio? Yeah. How can you be so sure? Any idea how many people Half-Ast has conned? People who are also just trying to get by. Who have families to feed. He's been asking for trouble for a long time. He got what he deserved. And he won't scam anyone ever again. Remember, rules are rules. With the whole world collapsing, we need them more than ever. Without them, we'd be no better than a pack of rats. Did you call this following the rules? Your rules? He won't get away with this. Carl will hear the whole story. Carl? He won't dare touch me. I know too much about him. I know too much about everyone. Even Lucas respected me. Who do you think is behind his death? Barney? Sophie? 
Barney and Sophie are just a pair of kids playing in a sandbox that's too big for them. On the other hand, they are really fucked up. You never know what might pop up in their heads. I know one thing, though. Curiosity killed the cat. Yeah, thanks for your concern, but I don't need it. I saw the potential in you from the start. But I had to figure out who I'm really dealing with. And how did I do? Oh, you're something else. But you still have a lot to learn, kid. You lied to me about Hubie. Aiden, Aiden, Aiden. This is no world for a saint. A martyr, maybe. If you get yourself killed. At least I'll have a clear conscience. Clear conscience? Wunderbar. <laughs> no one has a clear conscience here. And since you're still alive, neither do you, right? What have you been getting up to, Pilgrim? What are you running from? Next time, find yourself another Patsy. Feisty, I like it. We'll meet again, Aiden.